I saw this money with my two naked eyes. Koro, Koro, eyes. Exactly. Forty-two million dollars. Guy, I go buy Madagascar. I go buy White House. Bring and come live us. How do we get the money? Explain to me. You know, if everything goes according to plan, we go in tomorrow. Then cut off. What are you? I'm a con artist. I trick fat rich bastards out of their money. I con greedy idiots to giving me what they have. But this, this is I'm robbery, bro. So, what are you around town is true? That my man, bam, hit it big. What happened to your big score? Did you blow it on prostitutes? No, of course not. I spent 90% on prostitutes and 10% on drinks. With this, we can even retire. So how much are we talking about here? In a joke. Like I'm stupid. We're dick. I said she should this guy from the state. It's impossible, man. The house is impregnable. I counted six of them in the compound. Not to talk of the fact that they have guns and dogs and only Jesus knows what else they have in that house. But haven't you heard that the grass is greener where you water it? I'm doing this for us. Who is us? What lots of people who break into houses to steal TVs and pressing irons? Not people who did an 86 meter long turn off from one house to the other to steal 42 freaking million dollars. What is wrong with you? Blood of God. You think you're the only one with a girlfriend? I have girlfriends, okay? I have compromise. Who you be? I am in control. My word is law. Where is the he said his red blood serious. See, he asking for money. Mm, just shut up for about two million dollars. We die with the money. You must let go, Bonzo. Hello there. Welcome to yet another edition with the Konzo T. If this is your first time seeing me, my name is Chacha Wabara, and what we do here are movie reviews, trailers, and everything else in between. So if that's what you're looking for, please sit back and enjoy. And don't forget to hit on the subscribe button. Turn up your post notification, the bell, yeah? So that you'll be alerted when new videos come up here. To my returning subscribers and viewers, thank you for joining. Welcome. Sorry about the noise. Today we'll be reviewing a movie known as The Millions. It's a 2019 Nigerian movie that um, had notable actors like Amse Noir, A.Y., Blossom Chikujeku, Nancy, Nancy Insime, Tony Abraham, Ali Nihu, Broshagi, um, Etinosa Idemudia, Chuka Lan, and Folon Shaw Durujaye. Okay, now, so this movie is um, a movie that I have fond memories of. It was very easy to watch, it was engaging, and I had fun watching it. It centers around, Senua was uh, a con artist right and um, he had people like blossom chikujeku and ay who will bring deals for him they will pull those deals together and make money from the deal uh, the first scene showed ramsey noah conning this supposedly mute guy um, with his money just a shady deal and collecting the money and you know making off with the money and he blew the money in an hotel room you know with um, call girls and all of that now he's back in the club you know looking for one or two and just chilling that was just all he did with his money now ay approached him their friends they've done um, other deals like this you know they've always done deals together but he brings him this deal and he Ramsey Noir rejects this deal, you know, outrightly and says it is armed robbery, it is robbery. All he does is just to scam people and nothing as complicated and messy as the deal that AY was getting for him. And AY says, listen, this is $40 million on the table. And he's like, oh, wow. Meanwhile, there's this chick in the bar, Nancy Simi, who sends uh, the most expensive champagne, I think, to Ramsey Noir, who just, you know, takes it like, that and didn't really even didn't really you know pay attention to the person actually that sent the drink you know and paid for it like a 250,000 naira champagne so along the line the, the guys Ramsey Noah conned caught up with him and told him because he conned them of six million naira so they so the owner of the money said you know what I need my money right away I think that's Ali Neho and he, could, he didn't have the money anymore. He had blown, you know, he had spent the money. And 
nothing else was remaining. So he now says, you know what? You know what? I will think of something. See, listen, um, instead of you killing me or, you know, all anything of that sort, I have a deal, right? It involves $40 million. If you give me the time, if you give me, you know, yeah, the time, I would pull it off and I will get you your money. As a matter of fact, I will add $2 million to the money. And then Blossom Chikujeku has always been Ramsey Noah's partner, but, but had to, you know, take a step back because of his wife, Tony Abraham, who didn't want all those shady deals or shady people around her husband. So Blossom Chikujeku just comes to meet him and says, you know what, guy, I need work. Even if that's small, small work, money don't finish. And, you know, his wife has started complaining, complaining about the money and all of that. So he needed money to sustain his home, to sustain his family, so that peace will reign in his home. And then Ramsenua tells him about this deal and he says, oh, oh my God, oh my God, are we going to pull it off? So, you know, it involves the planning process of going to, you know, a very high security uh, risk uh, place or you know location to you know steal money and that place was really you know was security clad the security was really tight there's no way out they tried different ways there were different antics it was so interesting i even laughed they tried you know there was this scene where um i, I think yeah it was blossom she could they could drove his car with ram saying to, to go check out the place just you know drive through and their car you know spots there hey the soldiers came i was like move this guy see me oh see my life oh. it was interesting it was wonderful i i I don't know. I have this love for Ramsey Noir. Okay, he, he brings originality to his roles. In any role you find him, even as a houseboy, as a low class guy, as a very rich guy, as a well to do guy, anything he, any role he, you know, he puts himself into, he brings out the best in him, brings out the original, you know, the, that thing, that originality that I kind of like find um, absent in most um, guys who act in Nigerian movies, right? So now moving forward, um, we have. Tony Abraham harassing Blossom Chukujeku, her husband, you don't start again. What are you people doing? So he tells a lot of planning, whose house they will use. Incidentally, the girl that sent that drink to Ramsey Noir in the club also lived around that place. Just, you know, a stone throw. So in um, My Father is Rich, My Father is This, My Father is That, blah, 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 blah. Ramsey Noir was able to infiltrate, you know, get into her house and make her go a short brief holiday where he was now able to use one of the rooms there along with all those is uh, right they now drilled the hole 10 feet to you know all kinds of things it involved precise calculation i kind of liked what they did there you know copy movie what hollywood does in their movie getting the precision two feet to you know you know the way Chuku Cheku was doing that i kind of like if someone tells me he's not um, a surveyor or whatever or a whatever engineer, I would not believe. They were so perfect in their acting. They were so on point. It was amazing, like super amazing. At the end of the day, they got the $40 million. I was at the edge of my seat from the start of the movie to the end. It was as if I was also part of the, you know, the gang that went for that robbery. All the drilling, the, 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 the you know the floor shaking the soldiers asking why the floor was shaking what was going on and then the way Ramsey Noah had to go you know stage a, a, a fast party all of that I was like I beg people should hurry up and leave that place it was that wonderful it was that mad it was nice it was a good one a really good one now catch this when they left Ali Niho, his gang who was supposed to get 8 million from the money came and was about to dupe them you know, took the car, shot uh, AY and all that. The person that I didn't really understand her role there was um, AY's girlfriend, Amaka. Um, much as she tried to act the, the part of an Igbo, you know, girlfriend that was all about money and only had interest in money, she for me, she she, she it was a bit stereotyped. It wasn't free flowing, you know. When Ali knew went back and they were now they now wanted to count the money, then I saw that it was paper. So when they did Ramsey Noir arrange for the money to um, be diverted elsewhere. 
then there's another twist to the movie that made the movie you know i was like are you serious i was sort of disappointed when it seemed that when it looked like they were con and ali new was taking away everything now nancy in was not just was not a, a rich man's daughter she just that was just you know a scam that was a way to draw ramsey noir into it to put ideas into ramsey noir's head and everything else in between i kind of like enjoyed their romance together it was fresh you know it was wonderful i like <laughs> i was enjoying yeah i am on, on one hand i'm enjoying the romance between them two on the other hand i'm enjoying the scam the cons the scam and the robbery thing going on and then in the middle i'm in suspense every, you know keeping me glued like i was like oh my god you guys you know settle this matter let's know what's up let's just understand i'm going to be giving this movie um a nine over ten the sound was awesome the the subtitling was amazing the actors everybody brought their play and they just like the problem that i had with the blinks of legosians right it was coordinated or even living in bondage this one was coordinated the plot was towards a particular end and a particular purpose and on a particular understanding and everybody played their part to the best but in a coordinated way that brought the movie you know to a particular end i loved how the movie ended for me i was like okay no you know what i'm not going to lie down on my bed and like oh god what how you know this guy should have done this or done that the sound was check the the there was this drone that they used which was awesome amazing like amazing they planned this movie properly they they looked for the location they got good locations and applied the, you know the their color grading was wonderful everything was awesome from the beginning of the movie to the end of the movie you know everything was amazing okay so which brings my movie review to an end sorry about the noise this is your first time here and you still till now have not uh, subscribed please click on the subscribe button before you leave turn up your post notifications so that you'll be alerted when a new video comes up thank you so much for joining me today i'll see you next time bye